the following figure shows okay so here we have an equipment which has two prongs one that sits near the nose and one that goes into the chin okay and there are calibrations here right so this is definitely something that will help you measure something now in complete denture uh, prosthodontics we need to measure the vertical dimension at rest and occlusion why because we need to establish the height at which the teeth are going to meet okay so the vertical dimension at rest minus the freeway space gives you the vertical dimension at occlusion so we need to measure the vertical dimension at rest and establish the occlusion at 2 mm or 3 mm lesser than that height so the figure shows vertical dimension measurement using vernier caliper then vd measurement using willis gauge vd measurement using dacometer and horizontal dimension measurement using divider okay so this is definitely not a divider and we do not have any horizontal measurements to make in jaw relation for complete denture so option 4 is incorrect that leaves us with identifying the equipment because vertical dimension measurements are common to all three options so is it a vernier caliper or willis gauge or a dacometer so what is a vernier caliper this is a vernier caliper it has two prongs like this and uh, the calibrations are here this we have all used in our physics experiments before so we know what a vernier caliper looks like a willis gauge is a more specific form of vernier caliper where the two prongs go to specific points like the nose and the chin as shown in the figure and then you have to tighten it with a thumb nut okay so this gives you a more accurate measurements it was in use earlier now nobody uses it because the soft tissue compressibility becomes a problem and the third option is a dacometer i couldn't find a very good image of a dacometer it is also a kind of a vernier caliper that gives you anthropometric uh, analysis it was used in a few experiments earlier no longer used in clinical practice in prosthodontics but it has a similar structure to a vernier caliper okay a willis gauge is a more accurate way of measuring compared to the three but most common used is a divider okay because you have two very specific points through which you can measure and record the readings so the given image shows a willis gauge that is option number 2 so the correct answer is vertical dimension measurement using willis gauge